Okay, um, what I want to do here is just show you my 55 gallon salt water tank. Uh, just kind of an overview at first. I've been working on this tank for, I don't know, six to eight months or so. I think I finally have it about where, uh, well, where I want it to be or where everything's working finally. So this is kind of an overview and uh, in a minute here we'll kind of go in closer give you a little better idea what's on each individual rock. Some of this rock is live rock from a local fish store. Uh, a lot of it though, probably most of it I got from Florida Live Rock in uh, Orlando up in this, uh, not, maybe not Orlando, central part of Florida here somewhere. Golf-View.com It's their deco decorative rock as well as their coralline rock and oh my god the stuff that's coming out of it is just absolutely amazing. I'll show you in just a minute here. Alrighty, here we are on the left hand side. Beautiful orange coralline, orange and purple coralline up there. Some kind of a plant there. Beautiful pink lavender and there's some some little thingies there. I'm not real sure what they are. Um, There's a little, some kind of little button, we call it a button anemone, I'm not sure what it is, but there's a, I'm not sure what that is, I'm not sure if it's an atapsia, which for those of you not familiar is not good, they take over the aquarium, I think it's something else though, some kind of an anemone thing. Up to here, most beautiful, beautiful orange coralline really something whole patch there next to the lavender down here some uh, that green plants have I'm not sure I forget what they're called they're called the coin plant because when they grow out it's like coins stacked on top of each other Here's a little anemone thing. Another one. There's lots of these all over the tank. And there's this stuff. I'm not sure what it is. It's the most beautiful, beautiful stuff, though. It's just translucent. It's an anemone of some sort, but the tentacle things are translucent with little spot things on them and they're gorgeous. And there's my damsel. I only have two fish right now. That my damsel and a white spotted grouper. Uh, skunk cleaner crab, or uh, shrimp. Anyway, that's kind of the left side. We'll go to the center next. Okay. This is the center of the tank. Starts out here with beautiful lime green coralline algae next to the lavender there's a plant of some sort there and there's these I just don't know what they are coral or sponge I'm not sure but there's a couple of clumps of those uh, there's some plant kind of growth in some deep purple coralline uh, this is, I don't know if the color is going to come out here, it's brilliant orange sponge thing. Uh, underneath are several chunks of orange coralline growth of some sort. Uh, here's a 
plant of some sort. It's we call it a bubble plant. I have no idea what it's really called. It's gorgeous, little round, well, leaves or whatever they are. And here's some green plant. I don't know what it is. We have to find out. But this grew from. This was not on the rock when I bought it. It just grew something that came in on the rock. We <laughs> kind of like water lily leaf things on it. Growing like a weed, that's for sure, though. Anyone around here on watching this know what this is? It's really neat, but boy, does it grow. Here's some more of this orange stuff. Uh, there's, I believe, maiden's hair fern. And here, this is my feather duster rock must be 30 feather duster worms here on this rock. This I got from a local fish store. It had nothing on it when I was just look it was just bare rock when I got it. Now it's just covered, covered in these with these feather dusters. It's amazing. It really is. Oops. Beautiful, beautiful. Okay, from there where we were just at, we move over to the right side. There's my white spotted grouper lounging around and my skunk cleaner shrimp. Oops. Okay, well, let's go back to the rocks. There's a piece of that green stuff I cut off from the main plant and moved over to this other rock. It seems to be doing good. Another one of those bubble plant things. Uh, here's an anemone of some sort. Little uh, bubbly ends to his tentacles. And right here, that white thing in the middle, is, I don't know what it is. It's some kind of a growth, some kind of a... I don't know. It's cone-shaped, has chambers, tubes, and they culminate... They culminate in an opening there, right in the very front, like a pyramid, like a triangle. Hmm. I have to find out what that is. Here's a little yellow thing, some kind of a sponge, I think. I have a lot of stuff to try to figure out here. Please excuse my not knowing what all this stuff is. Actually, there's a couple of those, one there and one down here that uh, hermit crabs cleaning. Uh, here's more of those little More of those little anemone things, whatever they are. Uh, more coralline. A tap I don't know. That might be a tapsia. That's not good. If it is, I'll have to get rid of it. Um, there's Skunky, a cleaner shrimp. He's hanging out. He hangs out over here on this end of the tank. Pretty shrimp. So anyway, that's kind of an overview of the stuff in my tank. That's the right hand side. And I guess that's it.